Greetings, everyone. Welcome. Check out the gaming setup. Twitch streams. Link below. Hit up my Twitch streams at twitch.tv slash FB Aftermath. And uh, so here's my setup. Techni chair. You can buy chairs at technisportsusa.com. I love my chair, dude. Just. So, I know this is, like, politically incorrect, but we got Naruto. We got Broly back there. Two Brolies. Perfect Cell. I got Goku. All types of... Why? Why? Why, why the hell is... Why are you over here, bro? We got Vader, Darth Maul. And some sword users. Yo, shout out to Babe for the birthday present. Right? Beat Jet Set Radio. Come on, guys. Got me a big-ass Predator figure. Of course, we got to have Kratos in this joint. Of course, you got to have a Black Panther. My hitbox. A little drawing figure. Ryu. Hihachi. Uh, Kazuya. Mantis. King. Scorpion. My Scorpion mask up there. Noctis of Yoshimitsu. I'm just like this fighting game person. Period. That's why I compete in fighting games. So... Let's go. When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny. What's up, everybody? It's your boy at the Aftermath. So today, we will be going over something different for training. Um, what I have pretty much um, been working on is something to really balance out my power build, my, my power lifting, my bodybuilding, and my athletic movements. So we're gonna call this the, I don't know, the power building athlete, the athletic power builder. Whatever it is, um, I'm just trying to focus on these three key points, which means my two, two so which means my compounds, um, some accessory work, and then some mobility, functional movement, type work, endurance, whatever, something to keep, work the inside, keep that fat, uh, that um, um, conditioning going um, for myself. Now, that being said, this is how, today was kind of random. Um, this is how I've set it out to be. So we do two compound movements and I got this idea from the new blood from Super League. We do 25 reps, right? 25 reps, you have to get 25 reps done in three sets. So you're kind of looking for that 20, that sweet spot, that 25 rep max, right? That you can get done, a way that you can get done um, um, 25 reps in three sets. So, and you don't want it to be like too easy where you're not, 225, I can get that done once. So I, I needed it to be something where I knew it was gonna be a challenge that I couldn't get done. You know, maybe like something I can get done like, um, you know, two sets of 10 and then a set of five, you know? So it's three sets all together, as heavy as possible, um, get it done, pretty much. So that weight for me today was like 315. Um, and, and, and that's kind of what I worked with. And then, um, so there's two compounds. So today I did deadlift, I mean bench, deadlift. Um, what else did I do, what else did I do, what else did I do? Something else, whatever. You see me deadlifting right now. And it, it, it didn't really much, it was tough because I guess it's this keto, I mean, this paleo diet that I'm on. Dude, I was feeling so weak. I could not just like, you know, like 315 felt so heavy. And I, I barely got those 25 reps done. And with the deadlift today, I was just kind of playing with different sets of weights to see if I could even, you know, even get, I thought, I thought 405, you know, because I got Super League um, coming up for blood uh, next month. And I'm like, all right, you know, 500 for 25 reps. You know, and I'm like, yo, I could barely scratch 405 for 25 reps in three sets. Cause like, yo, it was killing me. I went up, I went up to like 500 to try it. You'll see in a moment after this 405 for a few reps and stuff. Um, and I was just like, nah, bro, not today. Not today. Um, I did miss some film because I thought my recording was on. I eventually did the 405 for, uh, uh, I, I went ahead and did 405 for whatever the, the sets, um, the, the 225 reps. I just kind of went haywire on it. I went live on Instagram to do it. Um, but I tried to work up 
two, the, the four, four ninety five. I believe that's what it is. And it's just, dude, I, I don't, I don't know. It's, I'm, yo, I'm feeling like so weak, man. This fuck, this diet is just killing me, man. I, I kid you not, yo. I had a cheat meal today. Um, I did have a pizza. Yes, I had a cheat meal today. Every Sunday will be my cheat day. Um, I'm using the fitness terms now, even though I hate using the terms. It's just like whatever, you know. If I'm gonna be in the fitness, I need to commit to what the fitness industry is about. Even though I, you know, I hate it. I hate, I hate using words I, and that that are like fitness, like gym head nerd. I mean, words. It's just, it's just so whack to me. Like you know, the gym, the gym lingo is just so whack. It's, it's so whack, bro. And um, but yeah, so we got our two compounds out the way. Um, moving on to some accessory work with some some shoulder press. I uh, use the same concept actually. The uh, 25 reps of three sets, started with three plates, went up to four plates. Four plates was my working set. Um, and I, honestly, I felt like I could have went up to five plates. My shoulders were feeling all right. Um, so that's that. But I feel with this movement, I mean, with this routine, um, and I'm going to create like an actual routine. I'm going to go over this for the month, have it for the month. I'm writing everything down. I'll show you the progress and everything. Um, but with this routine, I'm going to be doing, um, I, you know, I plan to, you know, have strength, strength gains, right? Um, you know, build a more lean, muscular body. I'm not trying to get massive. That's not the goal. To be super massive is not the goal here. Um, we, we want to be a lean, um, but muscular physique. Uh, if you're looking to just get like stupid, swole, um, huge, then this is not the the type of routine for you. Um, I don't ever look to get swole huge. I like wiping my ass, you know, comfortably. I like touching my back. I like still having some type of reach and flexibility. I like being able to dunk the ball. I, I don't like being um, considered a bodybuilder. Um, that's why I kind of like take it hard. But either way, moving on, as you see right now, we have me doing um, that conditioning. It's a type, some type of athletic work. Um, for the routine. And I'm going back to the gym later. This is just the first half. So I did the rope, 30 seconds, I'm just going for the rope. And then the last 30 seconds, I did med, med ball slams. And I did that for three sets. So everything is kind of like three sets. All right, three sets, 25 reps. Like, let's get it. And I think that's a cool way to train just because you don't have to like think of like, oh, what weight? I mean, like, you, you do have to think of what weight. But what I mean by that is like, you go in the gym, you know you got 25 reps, and your mindset is like, yo, I got 25 reps to spare. I want to give it my all. And I think that's a cool type of new way to train. It's just like, yo, like, all right, let's get let's get my warm-ups in and let's find that weight that I can do for three sets, um, three sets of, you know, two sets of ten and a set of five. Um, you know, set two sets of 18, set seven, or whatever, or 10, or, damn, my math is off. My math is off. Yeah. I really just said that. I really just said that. But anyways, like I said, it's a, it's a cool way to train. Um, and the gist of everything is you got um, two compounds, two accessories, and two uh, athletic movements right and um that's you know that's five what two compound two accessory that's six movements all together when i was a little boy i wanted to be a hero the truth is when you get older sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would so you gotta do what you gotta do handle that business believe in yourself create your own destiny